Hello. Uh, I'm gonna do another Cult of the Lamb pre-record. Now this is being recorded like a week and a half or so, almost two weeks after I played this game uh, last. Well, I mean, I played it a little bit just for fun on my own. But what I mean is, between part one and two, yeah, it's been a few weeks. And boy, has it been an eventful few weeks. For those that don't know, I got the Ovid. That was bad. And, uh, here I am. I'm actually... I am noticing... Like... I'm tired. So, let's hope that doesn't become a thing. But... I'm okay, mostly. I feel way better, and my throat feels a lot better. But, um... Yeah, I figured instead of me streaming this... Instead, what I would do is do another pre-record, and when, then when the game comes out, I'll play the full version. Because... The full version has all four bosses. And apparently... Before the game comes out, I'm not allowed to play all four bosses. So. So I have a little quest to find Jar in Darkwood. Um, I'm gonna do some more management stuff because my faith level's a little low. But yeah, I played just a little bit. And... I got... This tabernacle. So followers can deposit extra faith. So yeah, I'm going to work on some of that stuff, and then I'm going to do some of the second boss area stuff. Not Leshy. Hope everyone out there is doing well. Staying healthy. Appreciate you watching my videos. Please like, subscribe. Try not to shit on the floor. I didn't want to do the sermon until they uh, were awake. your blessing. Stop shitting on the floor. You're gonna shit yourself. <laughs> I know I have a follower who was doing farm stuff. It's not much, but it's berry meal. Yeah, I'm positive I had a follower that was um, on farm duty, and now they're not.
Maybe I took them off farm duty by accident? Maybe it was, like, turtly enough for the Turtle Club? Huh? <laughs> it's funny listening to Dana Carvey's podcast with David Spade, and then Dana Carvey, when they talk about, like, movies that they've been in, or, you know, they have a guest on that's talking about one of their movies, Carvey is usually will bring up the Turtle Club movie, but without specifically saying it, Talk about how he's been in, like, a terrible movie. There are no tasks avail available. Available. Well, let's do a sermon. They need faith. Good sermon. New curses will appear. Appear. Appeal. There we go. I can ascend a follower. What do you think that means? I know what it means. But no, they're fine. They're just shitting on the floor, you know? And then horrified at the shit on the floor. Okay, I need to build an outhouse. Seed silo would be helpful. Or a, even a janitor station soon I can get. I mean, if they could clean up their own shit, I would be very happy. Yeah, they need- they need a seed silo. I- I am surprised at how much I enjoy the management aspect of this game. And the fighting is- is good, like, don't get me wrong, the roguelite stuff is very well done, but this is- this is great. Baby Cthulhu is going to start planting. Uh-oh, stinky. I didn't realize they had shot, uh, shat... Shotten? Shatten? This much. I didn't realize they had shattered this much 
all over the ground. And boy, howdy, did they. Soon I can make a janitor station and an outhouse. Create resources. More advanced structures require consecrated resources. Water this stuff, friend? That friend was just like, nah, I don't I don't need to water that shit. Okay, I can go out and do some adventuring, and when I come back, there will be more things to do. are you? If so many mouths to feed, you must need some seeds. I'll set up here if you're in need of crops. Thanks. That's quite nice of you. Tempest gauntlets. Oh, these are new. I haven't seen these at all. Mental. percent chance of gaining a blue heart while killing an enemy, yep. I almost wouldn't mind, like, a zoom-in function. Just some method of getting, like, 25% closer to the action. I don't even know what these things do. Um, 
weak at first, but devastating on a complete combo. There you are. Heck it. Pathetic, sniveling, vile puppet to the Red Crown. You have failed. Or sorry, you have failed the youngest of us. We're the bishops of the old faith. We protect against heresies such as yours. We are the guardians of the true word, and we shall not tolerate such blasphemy. Your sins are many. For that, your loyal followers must suffer. They shall starve. Where, where am I, le leader? You just make my follower hungry and then send him back? Wow, what an asshole. chance to spawn better chests. Um, I'll pick up another follower. That 10% chance to get a blue heart is really helpful, especially early on. I have a phone call. Please, please be patient a moment. Sorry, once again playing during the day, so distractions abound. Must collect bones. There is a clip from the new Beavis and Butthead series where they're re reviewing someone who's doing ASMR. And it's very funny. Like, <clears throat> the movie was good, but I still wasn't sure if the show would live up to it. But considering how much, like, you know, we'll, we'll see what the actual cartoon segment of it is like. <clears throat> but uh, considering how much stuff there is, how much idiotic <laughs> content they could possibly talk about and be complete idiots themselves, I think it could be pretty funny. Like, just TikTok alone? Well, that's- that's a whole can of worms, isn't it? It's a psyop to make America dumber and give up personal information. I probably don't even... I don't know how true that is, because, you know, obviously... I'm not on there. And I'm not an investigative researcher of any kind. But, uh, that- that's starting to seem like the case. And not even starting. But, um, you know, I'm not really one to get into conspiracy theories, even if it seems like, you know, with taking away the idea that it's done on purpose, you have to admit TikTok is destroying people's attention spans. 
I'm sure there are many who would defend it and be like, no, it's fine. It, I, I don't know. We apparently have, like, the shortest attention span of any generation in human, recorded human history. Which is probably not just TikTok's fault. It's just internet. Like, how we consume content. There's a part of me that wonders how people end up watching my full, like, two-hour videos. But I think it's also... There's two types of... of... content. Like, there's the stuff that you just keep on in the background. And then there's the stuff that you just scroll through and watch for a second, and then immediately move on. Like, I watched a, a video about Galador, the, the Lego set that nearly bankrupted Lego, and glinching. Jeff um, showed me this video, it was hilarious. Because... There's actually a Lego set called Galador, where the main feature was that you can move the arms and legs from all the characters onto the other characters. And, um, it was called Glinching. That's, that's what they said it was called. Glinching. That, that's like a half hour long video. That's, that's not short term content. And stuff like that does well, too. Um... Choose lumber nuggets or choose follower form. A new animal form your followers can take. Ah. Alright, I guess it's fun. It's cosmetic. I don't really think I'm making much of a point. Or trying to, for that matter. But yeah, no, attention spans are short, but yet there are people that would, l like, love two hour long or more but, uh, videos, which I do. I like long form stuff that actually gets deep into a topic. Vessel, do you not worship me? Do you not give offerings in hopes of gaining my favor? When you return to the cult, you shall find a new offering chest. There you can provide offerings that I, in my generosity, shall turn to gold, so that you might strengthen your cult. But I am not easily satisfied. The same gift offered too frequently will cause the price to be lowered. Yet fear not, over time. It will grow in value once more. Give me proper tribute, and you shall be rewarded. You wish to pay me tribute? I need to move this thing. Dude's hungry. My faith is shaken, I can see through your lies. You are a fraud, you I must tell the others. Hurt, you're dissenting. Re-educate them and put them in prison. Bring them back to the loving embrace of the cult, or just sacrifice them. You make the rules after all. I have to make some vom vom meals. Tabernacle there. They're gonna start puking if they keep eating this crap.
Uh, re-educate or kill the traitor. Just sacrifice him. I'm very disappointed in this turtle. Oh, I guess I have a mushroom seed now. I'll do a little bit of planting, but I'm hoping that the other uh, follower that does the farming can, can help with this. Yeah, faith is very low, so I'm just going to sacrifice the turtle. Oh my god, do you hear this fucking thing? Holy shit! Your, your name is Turt2. The better turtle. I hate him so much. All right, Turt, you gotta go. Naturally skeptical. All right, well, here's your skepticism, my friends. You will be ascended. Turtmill, you you've gotta go. There you go, and enjoy your ascension. Absolutely wonderful. these. Probably need some food. Ballers will not eat or be hungry for three days. In an emergency, that, that sounds pretty good. Cost 75 bones, but it lowers their faith a bit. Okay, they need they need more faith. Collect reward from Oh. There you go. Um oh you, yes, you. Gushion. Okay, gain ten faith on recruitment. that. Oh. 
Got a number of level ups. Faith restored. Don't judge me, I've always wanted to eat a meal made of poop. Huh? Uh... What? Well, why do you want that? Thank you, leader. Now I must puke. Or just poop. In and out. from Anano. Oh. There you go. Plenty of berries. Now I can actually make some proper food. Not much food, but some. House, Healing Bay, Janitor Station, Shrine Flame, Harvest More Devotion, Cheaper Rituals, Janitor Station. Uh, you know what? Just take a toilet. Turtle, best turtle. Uh, correct, collect reward from Anano. Which one is Anano? Is that you? Yep. We have turtles for this. Alright, outhouse. I need, um, five wood, but... Oh. I need to actually do this with it. So a follower has to go and make the wood better. I see. I think I'd prefer to give them a toilet before I leave. Yeah, because they just keep shitting on the floor. Oh, 
we can't have that anymore. I guess I can build another tent. But yeah, this, this shit's a lot more addictive than I expected. Like, like I said before, minor RimWorld feel to it. Just a little bit. I guess while they're doing that, I can uh, do a couple other minor tasks, such as fishing. It's nice that there's actually some berries here, too, just in case you need them, and stone. I want to cook up some fish for my people. Simple and effective fishing. And the game is just so fucking charming, it's hard not to enjoy. Even if it is like a little simple mini-game. to actually catch some very specific things. I still need this octopus. Elusive squid, wonderful. Take this, I caught it maybe 50 years ago. The hell is this? Oh, it's a piece of a crown thing? Maybe. Lobster. Okay, so once I get all four, then I get one of these. Actually, I'm not really sure what that is. I, I think I know what it is. This fish has lips on its head. Wonder if I can go back to the bones. Back to the bones. Could could play some knuckle bones, but Build that outhouse. They're all just afraid of the poop.
Like, they look at it, they're afraid of it. We're gonna put this, like, over here. Help me build it, lads. No more poop on the ground. Probably am going to have to clean it on regular intervals, though. Yeah. You have to, like, receive the poop. Good sermon. Permanently gain half a heart. Possessions. Unlocks extor uh, extort tithes, collect money from a follower once a day, bribe follower, bribe to increase their loyalty. Why not? <clears throat> a little money to increase their belief. Nothing wrong with that. God, so much shit. Um, I need to be sent from bed rest or I could die. Rest until you are no longer sick. I guess that's what you get for eating shit. There are folks starving, no place to call home. We must let them in our cult. Recruit starving followers. Y you can uh, be ascended. Uh, actually, no, I'll just let you. Join, but you're starving, so need to make you some food. Some of this food's a little scummy and can make them get sick. That's going to be a problem. Okay, we need to ascend one of these new recruits. Nice. Oh, I don't have the money for that. Shit. Ugh, um. Oh, this is on cooldown. Sacrifice the flesh. Okay, 
We got a new follower that we need to sacrifice. Rip. Oh my god. Yes, wasn't that nice? Follower meat. Minced follower meat. 75% chance of causing illness. Oh my god. But you can also lower the descent. some combat but I just want to give a couple of blessings <laughs> you are welcome my child using the outhouse. Hey, let me bless you while you're taking a uh, shit. Is that cool? Just dropping a sacrifice off at the tabernacle, you know? I just want to be able to see the follower breakdown. Of who's doing what? New upgrade. Um, cheaper rituals. Fertilizer silo. I'm gonna unlock that. So we can grow stuff quicker. Okay, I'm gonna need to get that wood refined. Let's go fight something. Whoa, smell tasty critters. Hmm. I stay here is enough for you and enough for me. Don't let your followers wander away. You never know who might be nearby and hungry. Well, I don't have the money to rebuy this follower. <laughs> Sorry, follower friend, but you, you belong to that spider f uh, now.
God, that's that's a good one. So this is um, Death Sweep, devastating melee attack that can be charged for increased power. Possible boss killer. Five points to a pentagram, five portents of doom, five siblings stood abreast, five gods in one tomb. We did not wish to bother you, but... Shamur, the red crown, grows stronger by the day. Already it has succeeded where he has failed before. Leshy has been slain. Five becomes four, becomes three, becomes two, becomes one, becomes nothing. Shamura, rest, we will deal with this, won't we, Pelamar? Yes, sister, of course. Bow, or you will regret it. Refuse! Oh, they're all combat rooms now. Shit. Don't hurt us, we're simple followers lost in an unfamiliar place. The great Sozo sent us to find more of his beloved menticide mushrooms. He cares only for mushrooms, his madness grows. When we arrived, we realized we don't know how to find menticide mushrooms, and now we are too afraid to return empty-handed. If you were to bring him menticide mushrooms, he would certainly reward you. You will find him at the Spore Grotto. Huh. Oh. Mushroom people. My people. Sorry. I'll gain an extra half heart. Well, that's good luck. Deals poison damage. Um, I want to start heading towards the two time coin one. I need extra coinage. Too much damage there. Uh, tree stump uh, lamb statue. Okay. Increased chance for better chests. Ten percent chance to deal a critical hit or overall weapon. I get, I get the overall weapon damage. Now it's two hits instead of two and change. health back. Sure, why not? Okay, we'll go up this way. Double gold. Vampiric Axe. 
even more damage. Oh, and I sold the other one by accident. Oops. Another lamb figurine. Or figure. Statue. Is that why they call this Cult of the Lamb? Interesting. Oh, you know what? I have gold nuggets that I could turn into coins. stacked. Somehow I didn't see that this was a card room. Attack rate increased, yes. Stonehenge. Stand there and take damage. Oh, my followers are no longer ill. Both of them now. They ate the doo-doo. One of them did. I don't know if the other one did secretly. Two seconds of invincibility. actually better for this. Kill the adds a little more easily. Easy. Uh, uh. 
Um, pumpkin seeds. Um, hang on, hang on, hang on. Be right back. And... Catch critter. There are not enough beds for your followers, oh. to take a shit. I love the shitometer on the building itself. today. Yes, yes. Can I help you? We need to encourage the others to develop spiritual strength. Perform the fasting ritual? Her two is dissenting. Wait, why? Can I not have a single turtle? I, I don't understand these these goddamn turtles. Ah, hang on. Fucking turtle club. Curse of Tundra. Or... Necromantic weapons. Summon dangerous ghosts from dead enemies. So we're gonna do... This is still on cooldown, I can't ascend turret 2. Isn't this part of a quest? Or it said the quest failed. Before. I don't know why.
fight pit. It, it, marry a follower or have a fight pit. Fight pit it is. A whole lot I can do with Turt 2 at the moment. This one ignores dissenters. Not happy. They're fasting, and that quest was bullshit, so... Alright, um, we gotta find a way to make this dude stop. Send followers on a holy quest to gather resources. So that's one way to do it. Gotta get a prison. more wood. Oh, that's done now. Shit. Fertilizer acquired. Um, I need to chop down some trees. Because I need to put that motherfucker in the stockade. <laughs> no trees here. there. Maybe over here. Let's 
So this is shop. Rare decorations, all found by our great leader. We raise them, we sell them to raise money for mushrooms. More mushrooms. We must always have more mushrooms. Mushroom pillar to raise your flag. That's good. Cards. Uh, increased movement speed. Rolling it into an enemy will damage them. Get that one. Greetings, Traveler. I am Sozo, of course. Researcher of all things mushrooms. I guess that makes me a fun guy. Just a little joke. Sozo always needs more mushrooms. You will collect for Sozo. I'll worship at your altar. I'll devote myself to your cause. I'll rip off your head. Oh. Sozo will show you how to use the power of the mushrooms. Open the fragile little minds of your followers. Take the path to Inerna to find Sozo mushrooms. I like that there's a whole mushroom segment of this game. Wow, are you're still mad? Fucking die mad, bro. Everyone has a bed. I'm missing one wood. I'll build this myself. That way when they wake up, I can put the dissenter in here and he can enjoy. Takes a while. Good time to check your phone. Fuck, it's her too. Uh, base is an eyesore. Let's build decorations. Okay, well, we also desperately need more wood. do anything with decorations without wood.
Yeah, throw the shit on it. The lumber yard has run out of lumber. So now I need lumber so I can get more lumber. Well, shit. Down. Oh, I can't upgrade, right? I get. Losing faith quick. <sighs> I mean, we need, we need lumber. Darkwood real quick. It actually gets harder when you play again. And maybe there's more rewards? I don't know. Sacrifice health and get what? Oh, blue. Blue hearts. lumber. Ten percent chance to deal critical hit, which would be good with a dagger. And those hearts are gone. Lumber. All right, I mean, there's one way to do it. If I build two lumber yards this time, I'll be good for a while. I'd also like to possibly build them before the quest 
and uh, the decorations, that is. Choose this. So one thing that sucks about having got the uh, Arona. And the reason I say it like that is because I don't know, YouTube has some weird fucking algorithm. But... Okay, so I don't know if this is directly related to the Orona, or if this is because of uh, what happened to my throat, but food doesn't taste as good. I know this is a thing that... Like, I'm still congested. My sinuses still aren't as good as they could be. So that's part of it, but I know that that's a common effect that people have had. Like, I just... ...don't taste the food as much. I guess that counts as a decoration, and no, no wood is needed, so I can build those. Okay, that's the one I chose earlier. But it, it feels... Not like my taste buds are fucked up. Or that the food actually tastes different. It feels kind of like... Um... When you have a stuffy nose and you can't really taste the food because of that. The Statue of the Beast gives you 13 coins. I don't, I don't get it. I gave 20 coins and got 16? Or whatever it was. I'll make one more offering. Fuck it. So maybe something will happen. Statue was angry and my coins were stolen. Oh no!
Gotcha. Um, gold nuggets, stone. Uh, I'm gonna get the gold. Eye of Witness. That's nice. Continue onward. Greater rewards await you. If you don't have the Omnipresence crown, you'll not be able to return to the cult until you reach another teleporter. Um, I'm not prepared to leave my cult right now. But good to know. I didn't know you could do that. I actually have to go for a little while. I want to play it more. I want to do like another half hour or hour because the game is just fucking fun. But I'll just set up my cult a little bit and then uh, I'll get going and then, you know, add another part onto this. Not giving up on you, Turk 2. spend three wood necessarily, but all right. Let's build some decorations. Option changes. Oh. Pumpkins acquired, and two of the, the people have become best friends. That's nice. be on refined materials duty. I'm gonna give you a gift. station confession booth propaganda speakers the work and pray 20% faster that is ridiculous sure
There's your quest. Need five wood for that. Take a proper gander. Inspire follower to significantly increase their loyalty, replace the bless action, or intimidate, increase their loyalty, and they work harder for two days. I like inspire. they don't actually harvest this shit on their own. Maybe I need, like, a, a food station. harvest things faster. Anyway, I'm gonna get going for now. Um, I may add another 45 minutes or so, or an hour or whatever, onto this. Just because, again, this game is very, very addictive. So, hopefully we can do that. If not, then this will just be an hour 35 or so. But, yeah. Maybe be back. Maybe thanks for watching. Guess we'll see how much time I have in my life. You need to add fuel. Oh, like gold bars? Oh, interesting. Okay. Alright. I'll save and quit. So I leave with a question mark for now. I will play more now. So it wasn't goodbye. I'll say there are not many games... You know, if I do like an hour and a half, I'm like, yeah, that's, that's that's a video, that's no problem. But there aren't, there's a couple, but there aren't many games that I would just say, you know what? I want to go back and play some more. So we're going to do some of this, and then I guess I'm going to need... Since it's nighttime, I may as well uh, go and since it's nighttime, I may as well go and do a, a you know 
combat. Are you... You have no bed. Oh, shit. I need five wood to build a bed. Uh, oh. That cultist is going to be very upset. Bane Dagger. And I think this is the invincibility one. Yep. So in the time I've been gone, I actually had a chance to watch the first episode of Beavis and Butthead's Return. It was actually really funny. Mike Judge's voice for Beavis is a little different these days. I mean, the guy's in his 60s. <clears throat> but, um... It's still really funny. The writing is actually probably even better in some ways. Like, the first episode is them... It's on YouTube. But it's them trying to solve an escape room, and they just get stuck in the bathroom. Not to spoil the whole thing. It's actually still really funny. And then they review random shit. Like I mentioned before, the ASMR. Beavis is like, Hey, butthead. Butthead, we're gonna do ASMR now. And he, <laughs> this time they review some... some person screaming because they got into college. And another person, like... Uh, music video, country music video, and someone who uh, is making prison items. But that and the escape room episode, and then after that, the episode about fire. Actually really funny. Like, kind of surprising how well all this fits all these years later. In some ways, their stupidity is a nice parallel and contrast to uh, current stupidity. So I, I quite like it. <clears throat> it's nice when a show comes back and isn't poop. Uh, speaking of poop, there's poop there. Lots of lumber, very good. God damn. Just took three damage. Like that four damage. And that one screen. Oh damn. I should probably use my invincibility more. It was not so long that we cast out the Red Crown, a mere thousand or so years. Heresy it preached could not be tolerated, such noxious ideals it could not be allowed. For this most damning of sins, the retribution must be slow and painful. I, I cast famine upon your cult. With greed and ambition unchecked, it drew godly blood. Bro, they're fasting anyway. I think, still. Shit. That was a very penis man move. 10% chance of negating damage. I'm gonna need that because I am getting my ass handed to me. I don't really work well with daggers in this game. I 
may be an excuse, but I feel it to be true. stands for a few candles. Okay. Mushroom base incoming. for some extra mushroom. Uh, shoot multiple projectiles that seek out enemies, or... knocks back enemies. Um... I mean, hey, it's an upgrade. I'm, I'm no longer invincible, but... Possessions will follow you through death. <clears throat> that seems good. Vampiric dagger, yes. Ah, uh, it's another dagger, though. <laughs> Fuck. Well, it's a little more powerful, at least. Give me that health. Romantic dagger. Vampiric gauntlet. Look at this. It's got a little bit more range, at least. doing worse now. Should have stuck with the dagger. Sacrifice health. Fuck no. Fuck no.
Nope. Come on, one more hit. Two more hits. One more hit. There we go. Well, that got close. You are fine. Small gift. Gold nugget. I'm gonna get the lumber. Always use more lumber. Big lumber run. Is that a glitch? I don't know what that represents. Could be a glitch. Okay, they're pissed. They're 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 hungry. <laughs> they're starving. All right, let's let's start with food. We can do berries, meat broth, pumpkin soup. Please do not get ill from the pumpkin soup. You want to put a... play a prank? Make Gushin eat a bowl of poop. You fucking sick weirdo. How about we make Gushin eat a follower? I need three poops for that. I actually need poop. I don't have the poop. Oh, what are you doing? Are you... We've got a dissenter. You good now? service. Are you about to die? I am too old and frail, great leader. I have but a few days left. I, I have just the thing. I didn't realize that could happen. I guess don't get too attached to your followers. That fucking noise is amazing. In you go. Some weird graphical glitches that might or m may or may not be game related. Yeah, they're game related, but they're happening on my other monitor. So I don't know what the fuck that was about. Now my second monitor is just a black screen. Seems normal.
tundra curses. Alright, so this old... We can take care of this. We're going to ascend the old. Which one was it? I'm Deuce. I'm Deuceus. 44 is old? Oh man, then I'm fucked. Just a couple of years. a dead follower back to life, or you can conduct a funeral and gain 20 faith. Oh. Eh. I guess I didn't have to pulp Asmodeus. Emodium. Oh well. Thank you, Tertu. Tertuga. We shall dance. You can even do the safety dance if you want. Got any of that extra shit? I have to still make a poop sandwich. how much of a commodity poop was going to be. They can build the rest. stuff could make them sick. Berries still seem like the way to go. Plant some mushrooms, friend.
Oh wow, the outhouse was positively overflowing with shit. There it is, bowl of shit. Hey, I'm gonna inspire you, then I'm gonna ask you to eat some poop, is that cool? Sorry, I was put up to it. Demonic summoning circle. Oh, right. Send two followers on the holy quest. Why not? gold bars. I don't know if I have enough mushrooms yet. follower form? I hope it's a mushroom. Nah. Not, no crab. Damn it, I need octopus. Oh, man. Oh, man. Or squid or whatever that is. Joins cult two days later, asks me to make their friend eat shit. Mushrooms now.
berries be planted. Deadly dish. 75% of the, uh, percent chance of the follower dying instantly. Oh! Wunderbar. that there. <sighs> You're not ready yet. Got some fuel in there now. This is a uh, stone. Oh, okay. We need quite a bit more <coughs> for that. Let us pray. Is this ready yet? Cool down. I love seeing that turtle's face and knowing that he's gonna go right now drop a deuce. Cult members will gain the materialistic trait, gain faith when building better sleeping quarters, or all cult members will gain false idols trait, gain more faith when placing decoration building. Better sleeping quarters. Mission? Send Turtmel on a mission? Well, what do you mean? Turtmel. Whoa, 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 that's weird. Turtmel is dead. And I failed the quest? Because of that? That's kind of bullshit. That's also possibly an oversight or a, a glitch.
I'd rather send two of them. But anyway, that, that'll be for next time, I think. Alright, so this game just surprises me. Again, so much stuff that I enjoy that wasn't just the roguelite elements. Like, the combat is fun. All that stuff is great. There's actually a, yeah, Twitch integration thing. Oh, that's, that's online. Um... <clears throat> Chance to grow extra demonic appendages. Uh, I don't know what this is. I'll probably give it a shot, though. So, yeah. Cult of the Lamb continues to be very good. I'm going to play more of it. I'm going to play it live at some point. And I thank you for watching. And my computer monitor is all weird right now. It's like, just black. That's not good. Uh, hopefully this works and saves. So uh, goodbye. <laughs>